I guess you had to find out about this sooner or later, Suzume. For generations, golfers have been searching for the elusive Infinity Ball, rumored to create impossibly long drives and perfect short games. Well, I found it. And improved it. I present to you... The Infinity Ball X! Oh. Oh, no. But why? Why did you... Why get me to play golf if you already have the most powerful ball in the world? Ah, oh, I could fill in that blank. See, back when Bonnie started golfing... Max! Ixnay on the origin A, story A! She ran into some golfers and their inconsiderate rudeness gave her the passion Max! to... Max! Wait, wait, wait. I'm remembering something. That was you? You were that Vani? That Vani? I can't believe I didn't put it together. I knew I shouldn't have trusted you. Ah, uh -huh, yes. Now you remember. It all started right before the eagle incident. I'm glad you're here, Suzume. You look like a real robot golfer now. Vani! Hey, Vani, over here! I thought I heard a golfer's name. But that kid looks like a pop star. 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 Hey, what's the matter? Vani! Vani! Stop! Stay away from them! Apologize! Vani is a perfectly good name for a robot golfer. I'm the best golfer and I'll prove it! On the fairway. Huh? I can't believe those... <laughs> those... Ugh. Don't worry, my fantabulous fairway star. We'll find a way to show that amazing golf product. <laughs> Winning golf is no longer enough. I want the Robot Golf Tour Association. I want all of Robot Golf to be mine. Hmm. Okay, stop directly on. Okay. Yay. Don't get mad. Blah. I put in a call to someone that can help us. What? Ah, uh, but you see, I know them well. They're a fellow celebrity of my caliber. Oh, great. I know, right? They're at the next hole. In the sand, right? Okay, it's here. I mean, it looks fine. Yeah. Many strokes to be honest. No. Hey there, Max. Welcome to the moon. Or as I like to call it, Mason's Moon. Ah, hi there, my golfing pal. Nice to meet you. I call it Mason's Moon because I was the third person to step on it. If Buzz and Neil weren't going to claim dibs, I sure wasn't going to pass up on the opportunity. But, uh, of course. Anyway, I got a telegram. What can I do you for? Another fantastic interview with yours truly? 
I was hoping you could hook up Bonnie here with that ball you told me about. The ball, the infinite ball, the infinity ball. Shh, wait, wait, wait. Don't say that name out loud. I'll take you both to Mason's infinity ball. Just follow me after this hole. Hmm. Bonk. Now this down here is the infinity ball. We found it when we tried to stake the flag down when we landed on Mason's moon during Apollo 11. This weird object was just waiting for us. Don't you maybe think you could find a smaller room for it? Oh boy, this thing is more dangerous than its tiny size lets on. Mike Collins snuck aboard the lamb just to get a whack at it back in the day and, well, he sliced it. Wait, I remember Buzz and Neil, but... Who's Mike Collins? Exactly. Future NASA spends years covering up the first golf-related death on the moon. This ball contains raw power, and she doesn't take well to bad shots. Only respect for the ball can produce perfect results. Wow! Oh. I can show you how to hit it, but you have to give me something in return. Full funding for Biopals for 100 years. Susumi deserves it. Ah, now Mason, that's a tall order. Done. I must have this power. I must be the best robot golfer. Fantastic. Stay here in the blast-proof room, and I'll go down to the ball and show you the swing you need to become the best golfer ever. Well, besides me, obviously. Okay. Keep arms straight. Keep back from the target. Maintain arm speed. Remember that you're doing this for Susume. What's taking him so long? I'll never win with this ball if I have to wait minutes before each shot. Okay, this has to be perfect. Otherwise, I'm visiting Mickey C. Okay? No distractions. Three, two, one, swing! Mason? What are Oh you no! Oh no. I remember it all now. How? But... I thought... Well, we were behind the blast glass, so we didn't get hurt at all. Isn't that great? You didn't need me to golf at all. You just needed Mason to tell you how to hit the infinity ball? You used me. Well, it's not like I'm going to show them the secret now. I mean, I'm ahead, and... And you! All this time, I grieved for you. For you! And I find out now that this whole mess is your fault anyway? For what? Your own dumb ego? We're teammates. It's like I don't even know you anymore. No, wait, wait. I did this for you. Well, this is definitely not the clubhouse celebration I was promised at the start of the tour. Hmm. <laughs> Then Mason went into a swing, but shocked, 
Suzume walked in on him taking a shot. Trouble in paradise, am I right? Anyway, we're all behind the blast glass, so naturally my... Superstar Charm survived to tell you this story. So, uh, Max, buddy, care to tell us what the dealio is with that oversized novelty golf ball there? I mean, I don't see the oversized novelty golf club to go with it anywhere. Ha, <laughs> right? Oh, well spotted. You see... I'd love to explain this one, Uncle. I'm a professional robot golfer, but once I've proven myself on the fairways as the best... But you cheated with that ball! You're, you're not a real golfer! Once I proved I was the best and became the head of the Robot Golf Tour Association, I struggled to figure out what's next. What could possibly be bigger than being the best 100-foot robot golf? Well, uh, I built this machine to find out. I call it the Mega Particle Accelerator and Regrower, or Megapar for short. With this machine, and the power of the Infinity Ball, I can grow or shrink anything in the universe, people, robots, even the Infinity Ball itself. Oh, come on, really? Yeah, I've got to say, this sounds a little ridiculous. The laws of thermodynamics alone make this impossible. Not to mention, it's incredibly unsportsmanlike. Fools! <laughs> You're not seeing the bigger picture. 100-foot robots are big, but what's bigger than that? A 101-foot robot golf tournament? Think bigger. With the Megapar machine, I'll grow the Infinity Ball and my robot to impossible sizes. I'll be the queen of the largest possible sport available. I'll be the winner of... One million foot robot goal! <laughs> okay. Just a feeling. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Vani, the best robot golfer in the entire galaxy. My name's Justin McElroy, and I just love what a great golfer Vani is. That's right, Justin. Just look at this great golf girl. That's clearly the best robot golfer I've seen and will ever see. Leader of Team Chimera soars through the galaxy. Oh, you're so great, Bonnie. I'm Max. You can be on my show anytime. Oh, Max. I'm a shining beacon throughout the entire universe now. I don't need television. And here she goes for the first short game to ever take place on a nebula. <sighs> funny, funny, funny. Funny, funny, funny. Va no, ha ha ha. Nothing to see here. Everything's fine. This is all your dumb fault, Mason. I can't believe you gave this crazy person. You gave her the power to destroy the entire sport of 100 foot robot golf. The sport I dedicated my life to. And for what? Your dumb ego? For money? Why? For. for. Suzume, I walked in Mason's mouth. I've, I've played golf on Mason's Spoon. I've even done a handstand on Mason's Spoon. But I traded it all in for you. I give him the ball in exchange for your project funding. You're, you're all that matters to me. <gasps> oh. You you dumb idiot. You lovely dumb <laughs> clown. This is the worst idea ever. What good is money when these two are minutes away from controlling the entire golf galaxy? Do I have to do everything around here? Fine. Uh, Bonnie, we may have a problem. Max, how many times have I told you do not interrupt me when I'm in the middle of long-term planning? It's very important that wait. What is that? See, I told you the spare would come in handy. Now, I believe you're calling me a dumb clown? Still accurate. We'll talk about this, um, us more back in the lab. You know, maybe when we don't have an entire audience. <gasps> They're totally gonna smooch. <laughs> Well, uh, this all wrapped up great, but there's still one small thing we need to sort out. 
Who's going to run 100 foot robot golf now? I am the record holder for the longest drive. I mean, I am the most experienced. You are all dumb, so clearly it's me. Mm-hmm. <laughs>